So I want to talk about using foreign key constraints in SQLite to ensure data integrity. So a foreign key constraint enforces a relationship between two tables. It ensures that data in a child table corresponds to existing data in a parent table. That might sound kind of confusing, but let's look into an example. So first, when you connect your SQLite database, you need to enable foreign key support. And that's what the pragma foreign keys equals on line of code is doing. So now we're going to create our parent table called customers with customer ID as the primary key. And then we're going to create the child table orders with its own primary key, which is order ID. And it has a customer ID column that references the customer ID in the customers table, which is also the parent table. And so this foreign key ensures that any order that is put into the orders table must have a matching customer in the customers table. So we only want to allow an order to be placed if we have an existing customer. And so now we insert a customer named Alice into the customers table and add an order with a valid customer ID of one, which is associated with our customer Alice. Now to see the foreign key in action, we attempt to insert an order with a non-existent customer ID of 99. And as you can see, this triggers an integrity error, demonstrating that the foreign key constraints blocked any invalid data. We don't have a customer that is associated with customer ID 99, so we don't want that order to be able to be placed. And so this is how forum key constraints ensure that your data remains consistent and accurate across related tables. If you found this video helpful, please consider liking and subscribing and leave a comment letting me know what topic I should cover next.